Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. I'm having a great day. I'm kind of feeling a Keeper Hush run. It's the only thing we still need to do as the Keeper, other than Greedier mode. We gotta try it, right? Uh, although we are going to hold R until we get something that at least gives us a chance <laughs> on this run. I don't think that is it. In fact, that is, uh, that is definitely not. Uh, blood rights? No. No, 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 no. It's hard enough to avoid taking damage. I don't need to add the ability to do damage to myself to that list. Uh, okay. Uh, that'll do. Yep, okay, awesome. One of the best damage upgrades in the game? Pretty good. Uh, oh. Self. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. We just gotta get the, you know, it's like the, it's like the... Keeper jitters. Just gotta get the keeper jitters out of the way, right? Get the kinks work out of the system. It's like when you get a car and you, it's like, or, or more like, it's like when you have a, a car that's the old family car and you don't really drive it very often. It just kind of sits in the garage most of the time, except for when it's needed. You gotta dust, you gotta get, you know, shake the dust off. That's basically what we're at. We gotta, we gotta get our keeper dust out of the way. There we go. Okay, so we have two bombs. Ideally, we would like to try and blow up pots to get Swallowed Penny. That would be the preferred method of, or the preferred use of said bombs. Tears upgrades also would be great. Uh, okay, there's a couple couple pots here. Uh, doesn't look like there's any of them that are actually close together, though. I don't want to use one bomb to blow up one pot. Like, that's just... Not a good use of bombs. There we go. Uh, nope. Those are too far away to get them both. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna use our bombs there. Could use a bomb and a key to get into that golden chest, but again, I think it's more valuable to save what we got. It, this is not an XL floor. Oh, and we gotta remember... I'm an idiot. I've been forgetting to use wooden nickel. Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. Keeper jitters, right? It's like I totally forgot that I had wooden nickel. Okay, that was uh, unfortunate, but necessary. So let's just not die here. Careful. Okay. Let's try and keep him away from us. We got this. We're fine. Okay. One more. Two more. There we go. We've done it. And we get a damage upgrade. We get the better of the two Steven items by far. All right. We're down to the next floor. That was a good first floor. Took uh, that one hit against uh, whoever we got hit by. I forget who it was, but we I remember taking the damage and thinking, wow, that was horrible damage. Uh, I don't think we used the bomb to blow up the tinted rocks. I love the damage we're doing, though. That is beautiful basically killing everything we can't take the pill we can't do it like no that's suicide it's too risky come on ah you jerk ah man he ran out he ran away what a jerk all right we got to scrounge up a penny here ah that'll do unfortunately that means no deal Come on. But we only need Hush, so we don't technically need to get any deals if we get the right items. Piggy Bank is very good. That is essentially a not quite as reliable Swallowed Penny. So I'm very happy to have that. All right, we got Monstro. Should be pretty easy to deal with since our damage is great. And don't get hit by that. And we still have a chance of a deal. We are certainly going to try to go deals with the angel over deals with the devil. Because deals with the angel we can actually take throughout the whole run. So that's a thing. Uh, and we get a tears upgrade, which is great. Um, hmm. Now the question is, do you look for a pot? And I think the answer is yes. You do indeed look for a pot. 
Grab that. I just... I don't know. It's looking very unlikely that we're actually going to get Swallowed Penny here, but... Okay. Well, I suppose what we could do... Well, I don't have a key. Oh, wait. I have store key. I can get in here for free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and there's nothing here that I'm interested in. Which means I should have checked the store on the first floor as well, but... Okay. We're out, I think. Uh, although... There's a good chance that this is our secret room and it will blow up a tinted rock. So we'll check it. Okay, bomb. Devil card is pretty good. Grab that. Uh, I don't have a key. So now we're out. Now we're on to the next floor. That's the plan. All right. <clears throat> DPS is great. Piggy bank is one of the best passive items for the keeper. We don't have Swallowed Penny, so we can't get hit infinitely, and our luck is not great. I don't know if Piggy Bank uh, is affected by the luck stat or not, but long story short, we still have to play well. We can't just, you know, coast, but as far as Keeper Runs go, this one is uh, better than most. Oh, that was pretty bad. Thank you for giving me my health back right away. I appreciate that game. We are in need of a... Uh, you know what? This is the secret room. It's got to be. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought. Ah, uh, we can't. We can't do it. It's too risky. Okay, there's our shop. We will check said shop. Okay. You're gone. You're also gone. And you're gone. Ooh, that was close. All right, what do we got? Broken modem and red candle. Again, nothing I'm particularly interested in. All right, onwards. Okay. Ah, what, what was that dodge? That was the worst dodge. Why did I get... Oh, I must have gotten a penny from the room and then a penny from wooden nickel for using it at the same time. Careful. Okay, there we go. Oh, I, this, this is pretty bad. Okay, we're fine. Okay, we've made it. Now, we don't want to skip our item room. That's not a good choice. So we will continue onwards. That's going to give us the... Okay. A couple of free bombs. No complaints there. Sloth, fine. Was kind of hoping that would be the item room, but it's not. All right, Ace of Hearts is junk. At least as the keeper. Kind of when you're not the keeper as well, honestly. Unless you're in a really bad, like, spot. Health-wise, okay. One more. There we go. Okay, we're getting close to 15 cents. We're not quite there, but we're getting close. Careful. We've done it. We're good. We're going to have to explore this entire floor, aren't we? Just to find our stupid item rooms. Okay. There we go. Punching bag. Okay. Well, is it great? No. But, it's okay. And I think this is worth doing. Honestly. And it wasn't. <laughs> but it was worth attempting. I don't regret the attempt. That was close. That was also really close. Like, I should have straight up been hit there. Okay. What's left? Normal ones? Those ones I'm not worried about. All right, what do we get? Two of diamonds. Actually, very good. We're going to just pop it, though, because I want to take the devil card with us just in case. And now we are out, and we are ahead of schedule for boss rush. Kind of miraculously, we're going to be about a minute, minute and a half ahead of schedule. That's not too bad. But that's what having very good DPS will do for you. Our damage is very, very, very good. It's just a matter of... 
survive a bit. Oh, and we haven't fought the boss yet. That would also be a reason why we're so far ahead of schedule. And that terrifies me because uh, it's hard to go quickly. Yeah, yep. Oh, that was so close. All right. HP, please. Thank you. And how... Mm, that's not really a great trinket. Okay. I don't think we've gotten a deal successfully yet. But that's all right. It ain't over yet. Okay, this is a bomb. There's a bunch of money for us. Very nice. So yeah, we finished, uh, we finished that floor about a minute ahead of schedule. That's pretty solid. I'm happy with that outcome. Keep going. And remember to use wood nickel. The money could be very important. It could be some shop items that you get from having those wooden nickel plays. Gotta remember to do that. Otherwise, it could be bad. I say that mostly to remind myself because you guys don't need a reminder at this point. I don't think. Uh, I hate this. Okay. Uh, I will say, um, punching bag's actually kind of helping us there. That would have been a lot worse without it. All right. Explodey guy. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, not like this. Don't die like this. Come on. The flies. Okay. There we go. Got rid of the spawners. So again, another floor without a deal, probably. <laughs> Ah, oh, man. Keeper. It's just... It's just rough. Oh, well. Uh, so let's do that. Check our item room. Item room gives us mom's wig. That is a very good item. Very, very good. And our shop. Uh, buddy in a box? Eh, not really what I'm looking for. Again, you know, not... Not it. Uh, we'll use... The penny, I guess. Yeah, let's just go. I don't think we're in danger of dying just yet. More tiers upgrades would be very, very good for us. Uh, if we can't get our deal, wow, that was the greatest dodge of my life. Don't ask me how, don't, don't ever ask me to do that again, because it probably will not happen. Okay, hey, you guys are welcome to go down. The oh, they're all going to punching bag. Sweet. Thank you, punching bag. For making my life on this room a lot more tolerable. All right. Uh, this is bad. This is one of the new rooms that I haven't quite figured out the patterns for yet. So, we're going to try really hard to not get hit here. But as I said, I haven't really figured out the best way to tackle this room just yet. Okay. Ah, okay. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, boy. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Where's this last enemy at? There he is. Hold still. Please. That's not the last enemy. I'm... I thought I was dead right there. Okay. Ah, uh, I see him. Oh, boy. Okay. I really dislike these new turrets. <laughs> I, just, I just want to throw that out there. Those turrets are horrible. Getting the dime is pretty lucky, though. I will say that. We're doing well as far as money goes. It's the other way. It's always the last place you go, isn't it? Yep. Again, another floor fully explored, even though I'm not trying to explore every floor because we're attempting... To make hush. Okay. We're fine. Ah, I got hit by something. I have no idea what actually hit me there. Okay. I disagree with that damage very much, but again, it's fine. Uh, apparently, basically, what we need to do is just not get hit on the boss, like, for the entire game. That's, that's apparently the only way we're going to get deals. Uh, or, again, you know, 
As long as you don't get hit on the boss, you still have a 33% chance. That's how it works. Mostly. Come on. Pop up. There you go. Uh, we have 10 bombs. We'll check for a second secret room. That's not it. All right. Boss is the stain. Who is honestly quite annoying. And sort of hard to dodge from the side. But we've almost got him at this point. Careful. All right. We, we managed. And we get an HP upgrade. We get nothing. All right. We're down in the next floor. And still about 30 seconds ahead of schedule for boss rush. But if we keep fully exploring all of these floors, that's going to change real quick. And I uh, hit instantly. Terrible. We're never going to get a deal. At the rate we're going. And we're going to try hush. I mean, we'll do it. We may not be successful, but we will attempt. We will make the effort. And maybe we'll pull it out, but... I'm not super confident right now. We just haven't really gotten the tools that we need. I that's... Yep. Okay. That's fine. I mean, at this point, you get hit once. It really, really doesn't matter if you get hit more. As long as you, uh, you know, get the penny to recover. Because that first hit's the one that takes away the deal from you. So, after that, whatever. If you've already lost your deal... As long as you get your money back, it doesn't matter that much if you get hit again. Come on. There we go. Let's see. We've been there. Yeah, so this whole air, this whole direction is one big dead end. Is what it appears. All right, let's try going up. Ah, okay. Careful. You know what would be great would be Nun's Habit. Nun's habit would be huge. Car battery would be huge. Finding the correct and proper direction that you're supposed to travel would be huge. I don't think that's too much to ask. Come on. Dude, these guys are super tanky. How many times do I have to hit him? Okay, there's one. Okay, you're dead. You're dead. Wow. Talk about some tanky enemies. I got hit. Okay. Heal. We might as well check this. Okay. That was... Eh, that was worth it. And a luck up. Actually very worth it. We are badly in need. Sorely in need of luck ups. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Ah, uh, piggy bank, you're not paying out like you should be. Uh-oh, this is very bad. Okay, I'm dead. Dang it. All right, we'll try one more. That was a good, that, that was a run that started off really good. And then it kind of just went downhill. Library doesn't really do any good for us. All right, what do we got? Curse of the Blind. Uh, that one? Triple shot? Uh, no. <laughs> that's a that's a run killer as the keeper. Because your rate of fire is already trash. Um, nah, it's good, but not good enough. I do like, again, not good enough. Come on. I'm just looking for, like, a damage upgrade or a tears upgrade or a really good tier effect. Something along the... Anything along those lines. Or a speed upgrade would be fine, too. Uh, okay. Mom's contact. And in our other item room, we get Bob's rotten head. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's try there. That apparently doesn't blow up the other... Trying to find Swallowed Penny, of course. All right. Well... I'm thinking not good enough. Keep looking. Keep looking. <laughs> I will... I, I dream of a run. 
Hmm. Now that's an interesting conundrum. Do you take hot bombs? I think here's what you do. I think you hold off on hot bombs for now. You check. All right, so we've got two bombs now. I'm thinking swallowed penny, right? So let's blow this up and look. No. Also no. All right. Let's give this, let's keep looking. Hot bombs, that is good enough. Absolutely. Give me a huge tears upgrade right off the bat. That will do. The damage downgrade kind of stinks. But. Uh, is that a speed upgrade as well? I think it is. I guess I never realized that uh, Skinny Odd Mushroom is also a speed upgrade. And now I remember to use the wooden nickel and it's a room that has no enemies. Isn't that just typical? That's alright though. I think the, uh, the, the tiers upgrade is very, very worth it as the keeper. Because if you can get to a 5 rate of fire as the keeper, which is possible, like you're off to the races. You're rolling at that point. That's the dream. And then you just need a little survivability to go along with it. And you're in a really good spot. And this ain't a five rate of fire, but it's not bad. You might as well check the shop. Okay. Uh, can't take the pill. We can't do it. I don't know what we would actually try to buy from a shop. Uh, or, uh, for that matter, we probably wouldn't have been able to, but you never know. I suppose it could have been one of the shops that has the uh, the two luck upgrades in it or something. Gemini. Okay, Gemini, perfectly fine. We'll just keep shooting. Come on. So now we're looking for, honestly, a damage or a tears upgrade. That's really what it all comes down to. That's the, the keys to our proverbial kingdom, so to speak. Just try that and keeping this guy back. Which we are going to manage, it appears. Yep. Eh, get a speed upgrade. Speed upgrade isn't bad. Alright. We're off. See if we can take these out, clear these rooms, all this kind of good stuff. Might as well put a bomb down there. Check for a crawl space. Doesn't look like we found one. Not at all surprising. Kind of would have been shocked if we did find a crawl space, but I mean, you get a free check, right? You get to check it for free since there was a bomb. Okay, there we go. Also, self, remember to use wooden nickel. We've talked about this and you consistently forget to do so. Might as well check for petrified poop, I guess. Okay. Mm, penny. All right, well, was that worth it? Yeah, probably not, but. They got the little guys. And then we can focus on Sloth himself. Hopefully he drops a, a good card for us. Or actually, uh, I would be totally fine with um, Bob's Curse as well. Lover's card. Well, we'll take that over the pill. Just because I will... If I accidentally use the Lover's card, it couldn't potentially add, uh, end in disaster. Whereas if I use the pill on accident, it, it, it potentially could. Um. Okay. So, I think we come back to that. We don't use that just yet. Have we checked our shop? We have not. Okay. There's our shop. So let's check the shop and see what's in it. There's a reroll machine in the shop too. Okay. Well, this is an interesting conundrum. Uh, jumper cables would be lovely. We need to scrounge up another penny somewhere. So, I think we're going to put a bomb here. Uh, Demon Baby is fine. That's It's good enough. And then we just need to scrounge up an extra penny. Where can we scrounge up a penny? Um, Secret room? 
That'll do. We've done it. Okay. So we get that. We get jumper cables, I think, because jumper cables uh, will allow you... Here's the other... Uh, no, no, no. We still have our 100% deal chance. Don't do that just yet. Okay. Let's buy jumper cables. Because that will give us a way to recharge wooden nickel in the middle of a fight. Or in the middle of a room after we've already used it once. That's really terrifying. We're okay. We made it. I'm so glad that we have speed. He also only seems to fire... He only uh, charges once, it looks like. This particular dingle. Okay. Okay. There's the shot, and he summons spiders. And then when he makes his, like, super constipated face is when he charges. Not that face. That face, right there. The constipated face. Please die. Please die just a little bit faster. Thank you. All right, so we get Mom's Pearls, which is a luck upgrade, so at least it's something. And we get kind of our ideal uh, first floor deal with the devil as the keeper, considering... It has nothing in it. So then we use this. And we do that. And it essentially gave us... A free bomb? Basically? Worth it? Eh! <laughs> I was banking on at least one penny popping out there. Uh, okay, what do we got in here? Couple of golden chests. Okay, we may go for that. I don't think you go for that, though, until you bend into the item room. And remember, we, we're trying to make hush as well, so we gotta, we can't just, like, take our time forever on every floor. Although, if we skip boss rush, odds are we will probably make hush. I don't want to say it's inevitable. But the odds are relatively good. Okay, get out of the way. Okay, keep, keep moving. And we found our item right off the bat, so this is good. We really need a damage upgrade, though. Our damage is, like, hot trash right now. Our tears, as the keeper, excellent. But our damage is not at all. We're less than Isaac's base damage. Like, look how long it's taken us to kill that guy. Oh, and there's another one. Okay, that's fine. Please die. Thank you. Key beggar. Hmm. I'm thinking that's probably not what we want. I need my keys for myself. Especially if we're going to hush. Okay. Wooden nickel gave us nothing there. That's fine. Okay. Ooh, careful. Gotta watch that creep. Alright, there we go. Alright, you know what? Tell you what. We are going to go back. We'll do the mob trap room and for the two golden chests. See what we get. You know, maybe it'll be worth it. Maybe it won't. Oh, boy. Uh, that was absolutely not. <laughs> not worth it. Not even close. That was a waste of two keys, honestly. I think we got flies and, like, a single penny. Unless... Wooden nickel plays out, pays out with a dime or something. Then I'm relatively okay with it, but... Okay. That was jumper cables giving us an extra play there. Might as well leave one penny on the ground just in case. There we go. Alright, so we got a fair amount of money from doing that. Let's go this way. I can't kill them fast enough. Thank you, Demon Baby. Pride. Okay. And I see that Wooden Nickel did not pay out. Thank you, Wooden Nickel, for not paying out on a mini boss. I appreciate that. Okay. No, no, no. Ah, that was close. Uh, strength card is actually good. We could use it to, like, cheese a deal with the deal. Uh, a deal? A deal with the deal? We could cheese a deal with the uh, deal with the devil, is what I meant to say. Uh, we need some damage upgrades, though. Or something, because this run, I don't know. I'm loving our tier stat, for the most part. It could it could still be better. And in fact, if it's going to be really good, it, it does need to be better. If this is going to be a run that's strong enough to properly beat Hush. But damage is the, the big thing we need. Give me like a cat of nine tails or something. Hagalaz, tell you what. 
Mm, nope. It's kind of hoping like magic mush should pop up. Ooh, now there's a question. Ooh, do you go chaos? I think the answer is probably, assuming you can afford it. And yeah, there we go. Uh, so yeah, you go chaos. So we take that. That means we have a chance of getting deal, uh, angel and devil deal items in our devil pools. Our, it combines all the items pool, uh, the item pools basically. So, oh, that was horrible damage. And there goes, ah, that was also horrible damage. That goes, there goes basically any chance of us getting a, uh, a deal on this floor. Don't run into the shots. Dude, no. Ah, rip. The keeper gets me again. It's like, I just can't do, I, I just can't. <laughs> if it's any consolation on the, on my personal save file, I think it took me about 50 to 100 keeper runs to actually finish out the keeper's post-it note. He's tough and I accept that. And you know, that's kind of what makes the keeper fun. But guys, that is going to do it for today's episode. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Links in the description below. So check that out as well. Otherwise, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.